I know it's good because it's really easy to see. Is the color you can see is like oh my god what's up uniters and welcome to this new daily clip of this week so yeah guys i'm gonna do crepes i didn't have like a heavy lunch today and i'm so hungry right now i'm just gonna do crepes i'm so excited to do it with you guys it's been a long time since i didn't eat crepes and it's actually my favorite plate so yeah let's get it started all right guys i'm back and i got everything i need for this prep so first of all what we have to do is put everything here of course in like a bowl or something and i need to put first this the flat flat flower okay there's no flat i think it's flower i think it's a flower and we're gonna put imagine you're two persons that are gonna eat crepes so what you do is you take one a whole cup of flour and this is for one person so now we got one and now you two you need the second one for the second person i'm gonna open the eggs in a way i can open it okay i have to put two eggs egg for person you press the first egg and it's important that you put the egg like in the middle of the flour because if it doesn't go in the middle it's gonna be really hard to like move the, the egg after I'm a master chef crap <laughs> person. <laughs> ah! All right, guys, I already put in my second egg and I'm starting to believe that I need another one. You have to put milk till you see the, the thing you're doing is looking good. How does it look good? Now I'm explaining to you, but you need to move it a lot, really slowly, till you get everything. I need to put a lot more. It has to be like liquid, but not liquid all of it. All right guys, I think I'm done with this. So I wanna show you how does it have to look this to, to know that it's right. Okay, it has to be liquid, but at the same time, it has to not be that liquid. I'm gonna put some oil here, because if not the crepe is gonna be real, real like stuck in it. So this is ready. I'm gonna put the first crepe in it and I really hope this is gonna be good. I got the first crepe inside. I'm the son of a, of a chef and I, and I believe I took a little bit of my dad in my blood. So, I know it's good because it's really easy to see. Is the color, you can see it's like, oh, my crepe! Nah! Now we just have to wait, this is like, not the funny part, but you can, if you're like me, that you get bored really easy, and how I said before is not the funny part, you can like start to do tricks with the crap. All right, now you can choose whatever you want. You can put like cheese and, and meat if you want, or you can put chocolate like I do, I love Nutella. I'm gonna make this done, and I think I'll be done for this episode because I think the other members want to be here too so <gasps> i made so good one day i'll do one for you guys for you all that's so many crabs <laughs> i love you i made it right now i'm so hungry love you guys i have a little bit of free time today and i wanted you guys to see what me and my little brother do for fun which is borderline fight each other not in that way but we play basketball we're very competitive since, since the driveway is too boring, we're at his high school. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, that's right. That's the way to Hey, Xander. You want to put basketball down and come be a singer and dancer? No. <laughs> Okay, so I feel like it's become a thing now uh, with how tall I am. 
compared to everybody else in the group. And I just want to show you guys how reminded I am that I'm not the tallest when I come home. Sucks anyways. I'm gonna stick to singing and dancing. I'll see you guys later. Say bye, Xander. Bye. Yeah, end on a mess. End on a mess. This week has been a lot of running errands and getting a bunch of stuff because we are traveling soon, which is really, really exciting. I'm just looking forward to being with everyone again. Um, but yeah, so today has been one of these days as well and then I'm taking you guys along. I think Lebanon has one of the prettiest sunsets in the world. Zara man. I might pick some stuff up. I'm probably not going to, but we'll see. I grabbed the burger. Daryl grab some Chinese. Chilling. We are on our way to the studio. Make some fire music. Yeah, I want to hear this fire music. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty face, vibe is a mystery. Y'all want give me all of a distance. Take your time, ride it slow and steady. What's up, guys? So, I got the song somewhat done and I started a new beat. So, next time in the studio, I'm gonna probably work with that one. But yeah, it was a successful studio session. So, let's go see what the other members are doing. Fabio, come on, I'm going in the car. Come on, Valentine. Okay, I am going to get some lunch with my dog, Fabio, and then I'm gonna take him for a walk. But I wanna answer some questions about love because I love love. Wait, what? I have no idea how this started playing, guys. As you can tell, now United loves love as well. Okay, so I want to answer my first few questions about love because it is Valentine's Day. Who was my first celebrity crush? So if you guys know, um, in Peter Pan, the, um, the boy, Peter Pan, the actor that played Peter Pan, I don't know who he is, but when I was younger, he was definitely my first celebrity crush. I mean... <laughs> okay, this next question. Have you ever been in love? Okay, so I skipped that question, but I am now getting lunch that I always get here at Maloney's. Pineapple is my favorite fruit by far. I got my lunch. Okay, so I have got my salad. I always get a salad for lunch, and this is the chicken and avocado salad. It is so, so good. Let's answer some more love questions. Um, okay, this one. When did you have your first kiss? When I was 17. I was 17 years old. Next question. What is my ideal date? My ideal date would have to be something adventurous and chill at the same time. So maybe like, I don't know, I love the beach as you guys know. Or like something crazy. If you can think of like, I don't know, rock climbing or even like skydiving. Imagine that for a first date. Fabio, would you take me skydiving? I'm having the best company. What? <coughs> um. If anyone on your Valentine's Day, on a date, does that. So my date won't sit next to me. Fabio. Hey. I'm still waiting for that person special to come and sit with me. Okay, Uniteds, thank you for joining me on my little Valentine's Day with Fabio. I had a lot of fun answering questions. I hope you had fun too. And I want to say how much I love you, Uniteds. You mean the world to all of us. We wouldn't be here without you. So thank you so much. Yeah,